Jesus, your tumor. Amen. In the tumor. Oh, oh God. We well, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank Mama. You. Oh. Get up. Hey. <laughs> melody, melody. Hey. You're back. Yes, mommy. Finally. My daughter has finished from youth service. Yes. Hey. Shut Oh, Mama. Hey. Thank God. I miss you so much. I missed you too. Eh? Oh. Francesca said yes. she was going to come with me to spoil you, even if it was just for one night. Hey. Mama. Oh, Mama. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go in there and prepare. Mm -hmm. Why on earth would I miss my mother? Why would I miss you? That's what I want to go. Dry fish. Hey! hey. Juju. He's listening. <laughs> so, um, what can I offer you? Oh, um, forget about the trip. Let's concentrate on more important issues. Okay, I... Uh, Julius. I need your favor. I need your huge favor. There is something I need you to execute for me. Execute? What is it? <laughs> Will you smoothen up that face, my friend? Of course I am not going to ask you to kill someone. <sighs> So tell me, what is it? I need you to accompany me to Cherry Hill Plaza. You know, I want you to help me in picking out an exquisite jewel that will grace the lovely fingers of my son to be bride. <laughs> He's enlisted. You've done it again. Well, I'm happy for you. Hmm? But I want you to know one thing. Even if you want me to go with you to the moon to get this drill, you know I will always follow you. Yeah. <laughs> and um, one more thing. I want to see how I can change her wardrobe, you know? I need your help. Let me pick out one or two things that will make her look like a queen that she truly is. Ah, that's right. Um, Alright, okay, this is what I will do. I will cancel all my appointments for today so that I will be with you. Just in case you need me to do any other thing for you. Hmm? I will be totally at your service. Alright? Alright, thank you. Uh, I know I can always depend on you. Anytime, bro. Anytime. Um, I think I need a drink now. The drink? Yeah. <laughs> I'll get the job. It's a listing issue. <laughs> mm -hmm. Hey, I made this soup. Mm -hmm. Eat it, the Benya. Yeah? Mm -hmm. I'm good to go back home, Mom. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hi, yeah. Francesca. How is your mother? Mm -hmm. No, she's fine. When I told her I was coming to see you, she was so excited. Ah, that wonderful woman. She suffered to make sure that you live a good life. God, just bless every single mother that works out to make sure her children do not suffer. Hi. Well, you know, very soon now, they'll be calling her Nail Lawyer. <laughs> she can now go out there and look for trouble. You will save her now. <laughs> eh? Obria. Mama Yunko, yeah. don't you know that so many people out there have already started calling you Mama Doctor? Papa, Papa, they're already calling me Mama Doctor. Yeah. No, no, I think I prefer Ned Doc. Ned Doc. Ned Doctor. What's your name? Ned Doctor. Ned Doctor. Hey! So when I walk now, Ned Doctor. Oh, I'm going to go to Ned Doctor. Hey! Ned Doctor.
Sir, his name is ASP Kabiru, sir. Uh, his service records, which presently lie on your table, shows that he's an invaluable asset to both the intelligence and counter-terrorism department of the Borono State Police Command, sir. He was specifically sent for and ordered by the State Commission of Police to help officers in this division with regards to training and field support, sir. Okay. I, I have not even gone through his records, but you see, I am most gladdened by this new development. Inspector, this oversight function of our division has garnered a most terrible reputation. You will agree with me? I agree with you, sir. Everybody, everybody, everybody sees our division as the crime capital of, 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 of the state. Huh? So any resource or resources, human or material, that is availed to us to fight this menace of kidnapping, molestation, theft, hijacking, you name it, is most welcomed. It's most welcomed. Um, where exactly is this um, FP Kabiru? Where is that is here? Yes, sir, he's presently at the canteen, sir. He journeyed overnight to join us, sir. I presume he needs a tummy fuel, sir. Um, or do I rather ask him to report to you immediately, sir? No, 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 no. I... I will see him when I need him, okay? That will be all for now. Now that you've finished your youth service, don't you think it's about time you got a good job placement? Mama, don't worry, I'm working on something. And by God's grace, it will be good. Besides, he said he spoke to a friend of his who is a doctor who owns a private practice. He said that he will throw in a word for me that he thinks the job is going to be good. It's going to be a very good package. So. I'm hopeful. Oh, beautiful. That is good. Hello. Hey. Yeah. How? Oh, okay. Uh, how did the job go? You're fine. Okay. So, how is Mama? Mm -hmm. Have you finished speaking with me? Oh, she's there with me. <laughs> Give her the phone and talk to her. Okay. All right, hold on. Silence, <laughs> <laughs> jealousy. Is you my son? Ah, uh, Mama. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Mm. Yeah, I asked my wife about you and then she said you're fine. Thank you so much. And may God bless you. Let him bless you the way you have blessed my daughter and I. And if I'm not wise, I'm going to put this thing else. Just the same way. Ah, thank God. So have you eaten? We really go and give her more. Okay, thank God. I hope she's taking good care of you. Well, I trust my wife. I trust her. All right, not to worry, Mama. I'll call you tomorrow, okay? Hi, Mama. It's my turn. Let me talk to Izu, too. Oh, Izu. Some people here want to snatch the phone from you. Oh, it's Francisca. Please hold on for her. Okay. Thank you. Hello, big man. So you know how to me, Ali. <laughs> <laughs> ASP Kabiru, sir. I learned you traveled through the night and was still able to report for duty this morning. Yes, sir. Very impressive. Nigeria is lucky to have men like you. Mm. I hope you have been told about how terrible these areas of our division's oversight function are. Yes, sir. I am also aware that the Commissioner of Police himself instructed you with regard to the training of 
officers and men of my division? Yes, sir. And while you are that, you know, ASB, I want you to freely choose from the rank and file and officers, men and women you would like to work with. Okay, sir. Dinka here will show you around, especially those areas that need the urgent attention of your wealth of experience. Okay, sir. Let us speak of you, sir. That will be all for now. Okay, sir. This means for this is. Thank you, sir. Y and Terminal Z over there, sir. And uh, this uh, central point, sir, is uh, where the terminals come together to make up a junction. In fact, sir, this particular junction uh, has been known to be a very dangerous point for both motorists and passerby, sir. Uh, in fact, in our unit, we call it uh, the junction of death. So, sir, um, seriously, if we are to curb the menace of crime in this particular city, uh, we need to lay proper emphasis on this particular junction, sir. All right? Yes, sir. There is no time to waste. Uh, I will start work with the officers immediately. Yes, sir, right? yes, sir. Uh, sir I, I have to show you another terminal. Yes, this is Hello? Okay, okay. I'll come pick you up in the car. Yes? Uh, officers to understand that there will be a reward for all those who show tangible contributions to the coping of this menace that has brought this city to its knees. First tracking promotions, financial rewards, and these are some of the incentives that the State Commission of Police has promised. Are you all listening? Yes, sir. Are you all listening? Yes, sir. Listen, officers. You all will have to impress me. Is that clear? This officer should live well regardless. Definitely. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah. My love. You've been staring at the wristwatch all the way even down to the house. What's happening? You wouldn't even sit down for a while and at least cuddle up with me. It's been a while, you know. Well, my darling, of course I would love to. I would have loved to. Why not? I mean, you're here, but uh, you see, uh, something important is up. Um, headquarters sent a superior officer to teach us new techniques on security tactics. So I have to go for that workshop and leaving now makes me five minutes late. I understand. And you should run along. Probably I'll wait for you to get back home. You know how much I miss you. Please don't stay out late, okay? I'll miss you. Don't stay long. 
Yeah. I won't, I won't, I won't. Okay, this is your house. The fridge is well stocked, and uh, of course, uh, the kitchen is your kitchen. Okay, okay. Bye, right. bye. 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 Inspector Dinka, I can see that you are disturbing this workshop. Do you well to pick those notes after this section, not while I'm in front of you talking? Is that clear? Good. Now back to where we were. It is better to allow a criminal to escape than to kill an innocent life. Our duty as officers of the force is to protect the innocents, the law-abiding citizens, with the aid of a disciplined force and a cooperative citizenry. An escaped criminal can eventually be fished out. But, a mistakenly killed innocent life can never, I repeat, can never be recovered. So I urge you guys, in fact, I beseech you officers to study this very carefully towards the challenges ahead. Is that understood? Where did she do her husbandship? I'm uh, University of Just Teaching Hospital. Are uh, you service? She served in a, in a general hospital in Kaduna State. Izu, I know this might not sound irrelevant. Did she try uh, applying in any of the hospitals in the north before coming down to south? <laughs> um, Anthony, the question is not irrelevant. Uh, yeah, the opportunity did come up, uh, but uh, I would have gladly relocated my business platform just to favor her. But uh, if you consider the security situation in the north, you will see why we opted out that land. Alright, I'll see what I can do. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you. Yo, that's it, bro. Seriously. Okay, Dilka. Hope you've read that note from that building. Oh yes, I did. I did that immediately. And come to think of it, that ASP Kabiru is quite a fascinating yeah. fellow. That guy is the bomb. He is a very intelligent man, I must add. Mm, I agree. I mean, at least it is obvious to all of us today that there is more to security than what we have been doing all along. Of course. I agree. I agree. Oh, wow. I can see you guys are enjoying yourself, sir. Please just manage this while the food gets ready. I'll be out in a bit. Thank you. Just hang on, hang on. Do you know recently I have just observed that both sets of Ogadenka's cheeks are becoming fuller and significantly rounder. And I can tell you immediately without wasting time that this beautiful woman is responsible for the development. Am I lying? But <laughs> my dear, please just just <laughs> let him testify to that. Yeah? Oh, please. <laughs> Behind every successful man, there must be a woman. Hey, 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 my friend, <laughs> sir, do you realize it's your senior officer's uh, girlfriend you're talking to? Sure, sir. I'll double you up. Oh, uh, correct. Oh, good, oh, good. <laughs> Mama, yes. I was with Francisca in the city. Yes. When Izu called me, huh? guess what Izu told me? What Mama? did Izu tell you? Izu said that 
his friend that owns the hospital has said that I should come and commence work immediately. Hey! Hospital. Immediately! Jesus! Yo. Jesus! Hey! What are you talking Mama. about? Hey! <laughs> hey! God, you are Thank too God. much! Thank hey? God. What, what about Francisca? <sighs> Francisca is still in the city. She went to meet a friend of hers who said she's going to hook up with her own job. <laughs> oh God! Nakuya, one. I give you the second one too. <laughs> hey! Mama! Hey! I almost felt that while I was running. You see, Mama. You see why it is good to be good. Yes, so. Mama. When you are good, the blessings will rain from heaven. Yes, so. God is embarrassing you people with goodness. Yes. Hey, what? What is it? Ago, Ago, you're hungry. Go inside. There's food for you. Thank you. Hey, Ago, Chineke. Hey. Is a listing. I hope you realize you will have to go and pay her bride right before she starts working. Because as you know, in a crucial stage in a relationship like this, a man needs to strike with swift clinical precision. For the chair, like person we won't face court judgment. Haba, have you forgotten that my guest house is also your house? I beg, how well, Joe. What did you know? I've been one jab me in front of you. God damn you. <laughs> no, my love. Don't always let her get the better side of you, okay? This is also your house. Thank you. <laughs> yes, uh, that reminds me of uh, my um, barrister friend. Yes, uh, he says the job opening for you too still exists and you can start me. Ah, oh my god! Thank you, baby. I'm so grateful. Thank you. Mm. My baby. Thank you, sir. Uh, no, not too well. Oh, now you can sit and eat your apple. Oh, no, it's not. Very much. I'm going to do Yeah, we... Oh! <laughs> oh baby! Hey, Fine. Let me see that. What are you doing? Juju. Yeah, what's up? I'm fine. How are you? I know you won't notice me. This one has blinded your eyes. I know. Well, I'm sorry. I apologize, but I had to notice him first. Uh, he comes first. No problem. <laughs> so, um, baby, why don't you call me? I mean, I would have come to the you I'm sure you know the answer. I hate to bother you. Oh, sweetie. When it comes to you, nothing bothers me. No tip. Let's go. I'll be right. I'll be off. I hope you're not the one to No, no, no. I'm already on my way. Nice. It's a mystery. No more kidnapping, no more pedestrian mugging, armed robbery has gone very low. Whew. Wow. I'm sure the commissioner will be happy at this. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, sir. You. Thanks, sir. I hope uh, ASP Kabiru has informed you of what you start to gain in all this. If we continue with this level of success, 
anticipate your next promotion. Thank you, sir. But listen, I have my eyes on all of you. And so you must continue with this rate of success. Do you hear me? Yes, sir. Fine. Dismiss. very much for decorating my room. I mean, I almost did not recognize it. And the clothes. Oh my goodness. I'm so going to look like a queen. Do you like them? Are you kidding me? I love them. Um, I'm glad you like them. Thank you. Thank you very much. Sweetheart. Yes, love. I was wondering, now that you've decorated my room, how long would I have to stay there? <laughs> uh, so you have You won't be staying in that room for long. Far from it. Um, the time has come when uh, I will finally meet with your kinsman officially. Are you, are you serious? I'm dead serious. <laughs> I love you very much. And I love you too. Um, now eat your food, huh? No, who eats after such greatness? No, I'm not. I've lost my appetite. <laughs> Just try and eat, no? I've given my chance with them now. I beg. Man, you know what's happening for now. This is the greatest news I've heard. Oh, I beg. Make her good luck fall on top of me. Oh. Ah. Let me talk to her. I am so, so excited. I mean, I, I didn't see this coming. I did not this fast. You know how men are. I am so grateful to God. When I was coming to the city, I was coming, you know, because of one good news. I didn't know another one was getting ready to hit me. Look at my finger. My sister, this is the best news I've heard today. You are indeed lucky. Good. You have a job. Mm -hmm. And now you've been proposed to by a man you love. Very soon I'll be missing. My sister, I can't wait. I'm mm. going to touch me. This is your blessing. Like, touch me. 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 So, Mama, I I want this marriage to come up as soon as possible. Hey. <laughs> um, that reminds me. Um, Mama, Anna. I want you to have this. Oh, my mother is you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, no, Mama, I have this. Hey. My mother is already. Hey, is you. Mama, have Thank this. you. Uh, yes, hey, this is so much. Mama, no, nothing is too much. Um, Mama, I want you to meet, uh, meet with all the necessary people you need to meet with us uh, so that. Uh, this marriage will come as soon as possible. I don't want money to be a, a hindrance. I want money to be a hindrance. Thank you. Thank you so much. Isu. I am a happy woman. <laughs> and whether there's money or not, my happiness alone will give speed to my legs. Eh? <laughs> Damn. What happens business? What you see business is good. I can see that. Hey, <laughs> with this watch. <laughs> Thank you, Zoe. Thank you. I'm going to meet all your uncles. You go home now. Okay, that's all. 
Wow, just university chain hospital? That's fantastic. Do you know I did my residency there? Really? Why didn't you tell me? Hey, 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 don't put the blame on me, huh? Um, all Anthony told me was that he worked in just for a while. Moreover, how am I supposed to know what residency means? Mm. <sighs> well, even though you've worked in much bigger hospitals than this private hospital, I can assure you we'll learn far more here. And uh, am I wrong to suggest that you are not permitted for a large part to carry out big procedures in this hospital? No, um, you're, you're very right. We have a large patient load in this hospital. You will handle all kinds, and that will make you gain first hand experience. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. You know, this is likely, likely in the next few days, you will cover full flesh man. Listen, when a man is financially responsible, just to win the next issue be marriage. What? I haven't I thought about this. It's what I'm getting married to. I don't know, I don't know how. That's okay. I'm telling you, I'm not getting married to. I need to get married. Um, you know what? Juju, mm -hmm. you're my friend. And you've been my friend since childhood. Marriage is not something you dabble into. Oh, 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 wait, wait, wait. You want to lecture me now about marriage? Okay, talk, I'm listening. <laughs> Tell me. Um, marriage is not something. Okay, it's a... Uh... you could be mad. That is why I insisted you must pass through here on your way from work. <laughs> Listen, we your mama. See, we do not waste time to act when a good news like this comes. I will inform all that our king's men's meeting. Choose a day with your daughter. Then tell us. Mm. I assure you, we will honor it. Hi. Ude, hmm? may God bless you. Bless our friends. Thank you so much. <laughs> Why, Melinda? What are the elders living for to see? Apart from the progress of our children. That is true. In fact, Hi. this is a great news. Very great news. Thank you. <laughs> Dal, please have this drink. Oh. I know you I bought it specially for you. I and I must tell you, you have been a wonderful husband ever since mine passed on. Dal. Even you. Eh? <laughs> you know this drink, eh? I bought it from Innocent Hotel. Innocent Hotel, you only got you things of water. Oh, dear. Oh, thank God. Hey, No, so are you going to tell him? Of course, he'll be so happy to hear this, see? So that he can start working towards, you know, planning it in the whole thing. Hey. I'm so happy. Thank you, God. Oh. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Hey! Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was serious. <laughs> I, no, 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 I, I will get her. Please, my wife. Oh, uh, she's calling? Yeah. Hello, darling. Mm. Yeah, how are you? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm good. Uh, your mom asked me to choose a date with you. Um, all right, then. It's okay. All right. Can you still make it to the city today? Oh. Alright then. You should be on your way then. Waiting for you. <laughs> Bye darling. Um, so what's up? Is Melody coming here? Yeah, she's on her way already. Are you serious? Yeah. Then I have to take my leave now. Um, one more thing. Remember to pop in to say hi when she comes around. You know I always come now. Hmm? It's the next thing. Gigi. I will come. Stop! You have to escort me to the hospital. A police officer just be gone there. 
Just when we thought that things were getting better. Jesus. What a game. Come with me now. Yeah, it's a miracle anyway. Um, the bullet didn't get to his spine. The blood loss could have been fatal. The surgery was okay, and the bullet was also recovered. Thank God. I think he's now awake. Thank you, Doctor. Uh, doctor, please, I'd love to take in the bullet to aid our investigation. Please don't say this, don't say this, don't say this, please. Okay. Oh my god, okay, okay. I'll, I'll be there. I'll be there right now. I'll be there. I'll be there. Oh my god. My love, what is it? Oh, darling, my colleague has been shot. Shot? Yes, and my attention is in the United station. Oh my god, oh my god. My love, you can't tell me you're going to leave us now. Darling, please don't be angry. Don't be angry. Please, please. I mean, I now, it could be my turn tomorrow, okay? We watch each other's backs. Uh, please. But this is not fair. I've been here and this is the only day you're taking me out and now you want to attend to your, to your duties and leave me in the house. Are you the only police officer they have now? Why are you? Darling, we don't know whose fate is going to be tomorrow. Please, huh? Okay, please. Please, I'll make up for this. Please, please. You, you see what I was talking about? I've been here for days, he chose to take me out today. And now he's choosing his duties over me. Come down. Some days are like that, like seriously, come down. Not even going out again, you shouldn't even come down. Yeah, come down. This is the bullet. Thanks. Thank you, thank you so much. Or have it sent to the forest as a minute, you know? Mm -hmm. oh, so, can I see the officer now? Why not? Okay. Definitely. Thank you. Thank you. I thank her for your life. But uh, I need to know, how did it happen?
like this car. Mm. It's a nice car. I need to give you my car before you take me serious. <laughs> Listen, um, I don't mean to insult you, but um, you don't appear to be here, so the kind of girl that you match. Mm -hmm. Maybe we're wearing his best for each other. Uh, by the way, where would I drop you? Take me back to where you took me from. I should take you back to. Are you crazy or something? What about that? Please tell me where I will drop you. Exactly what you hate. Listen. Take me back to where you picked me from. Listen, listen, listen. I don't, I don't, I, I don't understand what you're saying. Just tell me where I will drop you and let me, let me look from somewhere and drop you. What does it mean I should take you back? Take me back to where you picked me from now. Get out of my car. <laughs> you're not serious, okay? Listen, get out of my car. she look like? Uh, she's um, dark in complexion. She's around um, five feet, seven inches tall. Okay. Yeah, but she appears to be tall maybe because of the heels she was putting on. Right. Yeah, she uh, she has good curves. She's very beautiful. Okay. Uh, lest I forget, she was putting on um, a corporate wear white shirt and a black skirt. Okay. Don't worry, huh? You'll be fine. Thank you. Okay. Inspector Kabir, sir, what is the situation report on the manhunt for the female terrorist? We are free all is available, sir. The police alert has gone out to our post to all over the region with the description of stolen vehicle. A description of the suspect has just been acquired. Also, I am personally taking this to the forensics within an hour, sir. ASP Kabir. Sir. Need I remind you that I want results? Yes, sir. Sergeant Joyce! Sir. You heard me? Yes, sir. Results. Okay, sir. Your bag, what is uh, What do you mean by what is in my bag? How can you just stop my house? Oh, a police officer is asking you questions and they are responding. Uh, Open your bag. No, 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 Your name. Let me just put a call through to him, please. Please, ah! your name. please, please. Let me speak to my lawyer, please. Let me speak to my lawyer. What's your name? Ah! What's your name? Please, please. What's your name? <laughs> this is God. If any of the happens to be the suspect, we may just have landed the jackpot. All information that we need to stop organized crime in our notorious roads will come through our mouth. Binka, sir, we are there now. One after the other, they are in for questioning. Thank you. How is it? 
Melody, listen to me. Who are the others with you? Just give me one name. Are you hearing me? I'm not going to ask you this question again. Just give me one name. Do you recognize this face? Are everywhere for security reasons. What? They would not allow me to see you? Even as your childhood friend? No, no, you can't have access to my wife. It's all for security reasons. Oh God. Okay, okay, um. But I hope you responded to treatment, right? How are you? How, you're okay, right? Place to someone she named Hobby. Oh, Hobby. Maybe she was married. Married? What do we do? Please. 
Yes, just have a seat. Come sit down. So tell me, how did it go? I mean, your friend that was shot, is, is he alive? Yeah, yeah, he's alive, he's alive. He's very, very much alive. Huh? You know, the, the only baffling thing is that uh, he was actually shot by a young girl. A girl? Yes. That's quite absurd. Strange things are happening now. You know, a funny situation, but still is the country we find ourselves in. <sighs> Not too so strange. You look tired. Let me get you something to eat, okay? Oh, please, please do. Please. No, come back. Please. Mrs. please, would you mind joining me? Okay. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. inside a bag that was left behind by a beautiful young lady in a bus my friend and I boarded. She had obviously mistakenly forgotten it and we only had the time now to go through the contents of the bag in order to find a way to identify the owner and thankfully we found this phone. Yes. Yeah. Could you please help me with an address to which we could return the bag? Okay, help me with the pen and paper there. Yeah, please, the address again. All right, dog. It's number 19, Timothy Opala Street. Yeah, you're off, you're off water boat road here. Yeah. Thank you, God bless you. <laughs> There is something I want to ask you. Uh, the girl I shot you. Uh, what is it against your name is? mention that name like Mirabelle or Melody. I'm certain it was Cynthia.
Yes, there's no problem. We actually need your help. I don't understand. My help, how? We want you to help us identify a body. A body? A dead body. And this was found on the victim. Talk to me now, talk to me, talk to me. Don't you talk to me. You cannot die now, please. Talk to me now, talk to me. It's me, Izu. You talk to me. Stop looking at me now, do something now, please do something, please. Please, you talk to me now, Izu. Remember, please, Melody. Melody, please, you cannot die now. Please, 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 I think it's I think it's I think it's easy. I think it's easy. I think it's I think Chai Obedinka, faith seems to be conspiring against us. Imagine the dead girl being a close friend to Julius. Ogadimka, I must confess I'm so so sick about this whole thing. Eh? Please, in your capacity as our superior, do something. This is becoming so crazy. Um, <coughs> boys. Boys. So, good. Now, um, this is not new. Yes, it's not new. I have been in the police uh, longer than two of you, so I know this is not new. In matters of security, things like this are bound to occur, so it's not new. So what I want you to do now is brace up yourselves. As men, as men of the force, you must brace up yourselves. Are you there? Yes, yes sir. sir. Are you listening to me? Yes, yes sir. sir. Now, boys, we must stay as one voice. One voice. We keep the secret as utmost secrecy. Are you there? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Are you there? Yes, yes sir. sir. Good. Very good. Lizzie? Lizzie? Ah? Okay. You came unannounced. Izu. Izu, get it for Sit down. Man. What is wrong with Izu? There's no easy way to put this. What? I thought it best that we come together. Nani, what is it now? Melody is dead. Melody? Izu? Which melody? The only melody between us. If I had known, I couldn't even sleep last night. Who asked me to use this stick on her? 
Jones. What is it? She, you want to land all of us into trouble? Hey! I beg, I beg, I did this, this kind of talk, I beg. Can you imagine what will happen to us if anybody hears you saying this rubbish? See my ampito. Not in the under. I want an update on the female suspect you arrested a while ago in connection with the shooting of Inspector Julius. I am really sorry, sir, that you've not been briefed on that, sir. Um, the suspect has since been released. All evidence gathered against her point to the fact that, sir, she could have been the suspect, sir. Are you serious? Yes, sir. since you came in last night. You barely slept. I felt you move at every second. Please. Am I by any chance responsible for this? Why would you want to think of something like that? I don't know what else to think. You've been acting weird. For one, you haven't even said anything about me and my friend going to see your, your friend concerning our appointments. Or is it okay if we go without you? this eh? <laughs> they say melody's dead is a lie i'm going to see it oh, 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 oh rapun oh my god rapun oh my god get it from me the only child the only thing i have in me for now people will call me the doctor that's what she said i should answer what are you about the doctor hi jimo oh god oh hi can you find this god Oh, don't you understand? I need to go and see her. Don't I want to go. No, 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 my lord, you finished me. You promised me. You've left me. My lord, you have left me. What do you want me to do? And lord, in this house, I want to follow my daughter. <laughs> Yeah, you have to be I'm not You know, like seriously, I can just wait to give her the good news. Just wait to see her reaction when we've shown her appointment letter. My dear, not only you. 
But how come nobody is answering the gate? We've been standing here for a while. Are you sure there's anybody in the house? Oh, is it possible she has started working? <laughs> you said you've been calling her line and she's not been picking up, right? I think you should try calling her husband. Let me call him. He's ringing, but he's not picking. Are you sure you dialed the correct number? Check it very well. He's ringing, he's not picking, he's still ringing. Good morning. Good morning. Please, what are you people looking for? Mm, we came to see Izu. Did you by any chance him this, this, same this morning? Mm, Izu is not around. We traveled to the village this morning because the wife is about to marry, just died. Gee! If he came Seriously, I regret having anything to do with the death of that girl. Same here. But can we keep crying over spirit, Meg? What has happened has happened. Hmm? For conscience sake, let's act in our funeral. Hmm? What do you think? That's the least we can do. It's the least we can do. There's a heart that is crying. For a life taken away Restless soul Crying for justice And the evil people They will never get away Make them pay For the things they have done Make them pay Every man, every woman Somewhere. Are you sure you called the right number? <laughs> oh. Oh, not Melody. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> if he can <came laughs> Yes, 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 yes. What about her? The same one we went to see on the other engagement. Man. Of course, of course. <laughs> She's dead. What? Oh my god. <laughs> oh, why? What, what happened? 
happened? I love I'm as confused as you are. First time I went to her parents' place to tell her of the good news of our job appointment. Only for a neighbor who was passing by came around and gave us this sad news. My love, take a look at the picture of my friend. This is her. I love she was young. She was vibrant. I don't know how death. Thing has happened and you've really tried for her. Let God reveal her killers here. I think what she, you should be thinking most here is how to give her a befitting burial. And there's no time to be watching on her pictures. Please, for your head condition. Okay? Please. Let me have this, okay? Please, please. Please, Isu, please. I know how you feel, okay? Inspector Julius, I hope you're feeling stronger now. Um, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Um, sir, the doctor said uh, the whole occurrence was a miracle and that um, under 10 weeks I will make full recovery. Mm -hmm. Sir, no major organs was pierced and the bullets that got into my abdomen somehow lodged into an empty space. Wow. It's yeah. indeed a miracle, sir. Oh. Oh, 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 I'm so happy for you. Yes, thank you, sir. You're a fine officer. I'm so happy for you. Thank you, sir. Oh, oh sir. I want to ask you something. What is it? Um, sir, it's regarding um, the young lady that was arrested by officers from this division the day I was shot. Under the suspicion of connection um, regarding my shooting incident. Yes, yeah, sir. Um, can you recall what happened to her? Oh, I remember asking A.S.P. Kabira about it. You see, he said she had been released. That they could not establish, you know, any evidence linking her to the crime. So they had to let her go, you know. But that reminds me, he has not even dropped any written report about the incident on my table. Get him across now. Let me see. According to our tradition, she will be buried in the bush. But for the last time, we will behold the face of our daughter, Melody who has brought so much joy to our lives. Melody! How? Melody, Mama! Hey! Mone, dog! It's okay, it's okay. No, it's not okay. Oh, my God, my Mone, doctor! Hey! Hello, ma'am! Oh! Oh, Hey! Unasis and I'm so okay. Unus Rapum, Unasis and I'm okay. Oh! 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 Melody! Melody!
मैं लौटी
don't know that so many people out there have already started calling you Mama Doctor. Mama Babo, they're already calling me Mama Doctor. No, no, I think I prefer Ned Doc. Ned Doc? Mm, Ned Doctor. <laughs> okay, also. Ned Doctor. Hey! Ned Doctor. Hey! So when I walk now, Ned Doctor. Ned Doctor. Ned Doctor. Ned Doctor. I have a confession to make. A confession? I was the one who shot an officer not too long ago. Jesus Christ! What? What happened? Sir, she just confessed she was one of some of the officers. What? You, sh you shot an officer? That's a bad. Let's go. How did the burial go, officer? It went well, sir. The atmosphere was so sorrowful that my officers got emotionally drained afterwards. I permitted her to go home to clear their head, sir. And those on night duties will return afterwards, sir. That's okay. That's okay. Um, what's your name? Sir. I remember asking you about a certain lady that was arrested on suspicion of the shooting of Inspector Julius. Remember? I remember, sir. What I don't understand, um, officer, sir. is that I, I don't know why up till now I have not received a written report on that incident on my table. I am really sorry, sir. It was an oversight. Uh, I'll have the report uh, retrieved and forwarded to your desk, sir. Yes, we can be Sir. I don't like oversights. I'm so sorry, sir. Yes, come in. Hello. Uh, Dinka. Um, can you please step aside with me for a moment, please? Good to see you. Okay. Thank you. Yes. I don't know if it's me or my imagination. 
You think I've been acting very funny of late. And I'm getting really uncomfortable. I think it has something to do with my presence. I'll have to leave the house. I'm all confused. I don't know. I just don't know. I'm as confused as you are. Oga was asking me why he hasn't seen a full report on that girl we arrested the day Julius was shot. The whole situation now is highly explosive. So what, what do we do? That is what I am here. There is now a need for an elaborate command. For me, the report has to be created. You understood? Yes. And all those involved have to be brief on one story so I'm not to sleep out of any way one time on this video. Do you understand me? And I want you to get them involved immediately and brief them. Okay? Go back inside. All this is you are saying, I don't just understand. You know why I just returned from Peria? Let's go in and check. Let's go in and check that it's good. Come with me, with me, with me. I see what I'm looking for. What is it? Sir, you can't believe this. The girl openly confessed she committed the crime. We have some strange SB which was retrieved from her. I suspect this represents charm of some sort. The report has to be watertight and convincing. You will write it. Me? Yes, you. We are all in this because of the city fit tableau to a young lady's head. Remember? Okay, I will. Good. We need to get the DPO off our pack as soon as possible. officers were on duty last night when you came along with Ibe to visit a female suspect in cell 2 and now you claim you don't know how he died exactly sir I, I can tell you immediately that I don't know what happened to Ibe honestly will you shut up yes sir shut up, shut up! officers sir take this idiot out and torture him until he remembers how he did that. 
Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Please, sir. I, I don't want anything about it. Please. Please, sir. Scaring me. What's 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 all this? Is you talk to me? What's what's all this special prayer? Like seriously, tell me. What did you write on that letter you dropped on the chest? I was only telling her how much I love her and how much I would never, ever forget her. Take no offense, but having seen the rituals you're performing here, I would say I don't believe you. Is it look? Unexplained circumstances that surrounded Melody's death troubles me. And I have confirmed from an insider that your own very Melody was wrongly arrested on the day I was shot. And with everybody I've spoken with, they all claim that they released her almost immediately. I want to know what is in my head, right? I'll tell you. I seek vengeance. I seek justice. On everybody, all those behind the death of my beloved Melody. I want them to suffer. I want them to look for peace and never find it. I want their lives miserable. I want their lives to live in hell. But I feel so impotent. It's okay. If he came and you're a beginning, you're a beginning, and I got help. I went my mind, find a semi deep, I need to be, I need to be, find a semi deep. It is that the great mystery to me. The truth is that we can't place any suspect or motive to the killing. And the most baffling thing is that it seems to have occurred right here in the station premises. Sir, the number of distasteful events occurring are just too many to comprehend. Sir, there is something I want to ask you. What is it? As, uh, um, there was a girl said to have been arrested on the day I was shot, on suspicion of having been the one responsible. Oh, she was released not um, too long after. Sir, please, can you remember her name? No, I can't. Um, sir, does the name um, Melody sound like what she called herself? Melody. Uh, where are they? Mary dead. In, you know what? Uh, I'll check it up. Okay? You know we deal with too many names and it's only natural that we miss this up from time to time. Alright. Um, okay. Sir, I will greatly appreciate the information. Okay. So, Thank you, sir. new piece of information reaching me now is that uh, Melody was arrested the same day Julius was shot. I mean, this appears to me more than a coincidence. 
The police officers that arrested her are recorded to have been the last people that saw her. Well, I think I get your point. Because this seems more than a coincidence to me. Well, Francisca, what do you think? Yeah, but I think we haven't waited. Make them beg for the things they have done. Make them beg Tinka, I said you should answer me. Answer you what? Answer the question I asked you before. What kind of question do you... Look, you know what? I don't like where this conversation is going right now and... What's this? Tinka. Look into my eyes and tell me you have no knowledge of who killed Melody. And then I can let you in. What's wrong with you? No, seriously, what has gotten into you? No, wait, wait, hold on. Are you, are you now accusing me of killing your friend? Is that it? Tinka, take a good look at yourself. You've been dodging the same question I have been asking you for days and you expect me to be comfortable? You pace from one end of the house to the other. You stare into thin space and talk to yourself like someone who is mentally disillusioned. And you expect me to be fine. My love, I am your sister. Your friend, your confidence, and the woman you say you love. If you can't talk to me, then who would you talk to? Please, tell me, do you have any idea of the officer who arrested Melody? Why would Melody be arrested in the first place? I know nothing about Melody's arrest, and I don't know where you're getting your ideas from. Now let me pass. I see you go nowhere until you tell me what happened to my friend. I was told you came along with the Met Police officer to his house to report about his friend's death. Who was that man? You mean Ibe? He died last night in the police station. <sighs> well, my condolences. I'm deeply sorry. Thank you. I still have one more question for you, please. Can you ever remember seeing Melody alive before she died? And what kind of stupid question is that? So the girl you talk about who owned up to shooting Julius, where is she now? She's in cell number two. your name. I gave no time for any nonsense. I said, what is your name? Your name, your name. Nobody seems to know anything about it. I am equally baffled, sir. Yes, B. Sir. I want you to get to the bottom of this matter. 
Yes, sir. I will start the investigation immediately, sir. That will be all for now. to play deaf and dumb? Listen, it's on record that you confessed to shooting a police officer in this station. So don't play deaf and dumb with me, okay? Don't play games. I am going to ask you once again, what is your name? Play down there. Want to play games? Officer. Sir. Take this idiot back to the police cell. By the time yes, we are sir. done with her, she would know how much we value time in this station. Take her away. Jibola. Sir. When I was leaving the DPO's office, I saw a lady being matched in by Ola. Okay. There is something peculiar about her features. How do you mean, sir? Aside you, looks like the devil confessed to shooting Julius. You know what? I need you to get close up with her as soon as you can. Is that clear? Okay, sir. That won't be a problem, sir. She never met men of their life. But there was this sudden aggression about her behavior. Behavior? What? How do you mean? You know, she seems overly defensive to me. Nevertheless, I believe we'll question her thoroughly when we've taken the matter to the court. Definitely, definitely. Ify, you can't believe I got some strange information from her. Strange information. You know, the policeman in whose company she visited Isu uh -huh. to make him come at this fine middle of this body. Uh -huh, uh -huh. What about him? Is this some, what, what happened? He's dead. What? Kabo. Sir. From what I'm seeing here, you're asking for a request to some other place? Yes, sir. Listen, Jones. I know that the recent event has taken its toll on all of us. 
But don't you think that a transfer is rather extreme? Sir, I know it may seem so, but the reason I request for this transfer is because I want to be closer to my family. Officer, I know you have your good reasons. No doubt. But you're one of my best hands in this station. And I don't want to lose you in a hurry. So I'd like you to sleep over it, okay? No, no, just give it a second thought. Alright? Time we had much more rigorous tortures. What's your problem? Now we are sticking to the plan. You know nothing of our death, and that's it. I want you to do me a favor. I want to have a word with Kabiru. Please. Oh. Yes. Who the girl in cell number two was? 
was. Yes, was. She was a person who confessed to shooting Julius. She was meant to be in cell number two. I and two other officers went in there and we met an empty cell. Sir, the reason I want to see that girl is because she was the last person that Ibe saw before he died. I want to see that girl because I need to clear my name. Sir, I must clear my name. Look up now. Oh, I can't believe you know I don't have this time. Suspect is said to kill me. What did you say her name is? I don't remember. She didn't say, sir. We've searched through her personal effect, but nothing about identification was found, sir. I need to see those effects now! Yes, sir. Thank you. I just imagine what I just saw. I know it sounds spooky, but she looks so like Melody. Yes, please. The resemblance is just too much to be a coincidence. I mean, could she have been a twin? Because I, I, I just don't understand. There are eight. Is it that the girl has a twin sister or something? Seriously. When I looked into her eyes, I could swear she was that girl who was killed. I'm telling you. Wait there, I Um, you know Jilos is meant to be identified anytime soon. And who knows if there's any possible explanation that will coming out of that. Koyemi mo. Is it truly your name or is it an alias? My name is Cynthia. 
Cynthia Macaulay. So why did you try to kill me and why were you interested in my car? I'm a pro. I wasn't just interested in your car. I wanted it. Anything Cynthia was, she gets. I shot you because it didn't matter. Yes, you didn't. Only your car did. Cynthia was born to terminate lives. I've been in this job for a very long time. Quite a number of casualties have arisen in the process over time. I can give you examples of the jobs I've done and details. But first, you need a very important information from me. What is that? How to bring in the entire network of car hijackers in this city. Number four, Old Hospital Road. That is the address. It's perfect timing. You can successfully grab all the king things at once. Izu, I know it is not the right time and I equally know there may be no right time for me to do what I'm about to do. This belongs to Melody. It's her documents. but we need to have them to help our sense of hope. For example, I am just coming back from the station where I successfully met with my shooter face to face. Are you serious? Yes, I am serious. Right now she's helping us aid um, some useful information, I mean some solid intelligence. So we are moving in our gang once we get the green light. That's nice. Yes. It's okay. This is the document on the girl that handed herself over to her husband. What I want you to do is uh, go through it. Um, put a date on it. Sign it. Alright, sir. Not to do all right. Alright, sir. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! How do you mean? It's up here, you What is going on here? What is going on here? Sit down. Sit down. What is going on here? What madness is going on here? That document on the girl in cell 2 is a document I want to use to go to court. I want to give it to the lawyers. What is going on here? W! Sir? Oh my god. You know what? W, you know? Look, you are going to plan a raid on that address she gave us. Tonight! Okay, sir. And I want you to tell your boys to bring that girl in cell too to the interrogation room. I want to ask her some questions myself. Okay? Alright, sir. That will be all for me.
you heard me. Who are you? We have given you access to your lawyer and to any of your relatives. But surprisingly, no one has come to look for me. Why? Why are you so interested in helping us? Crimes have been committed and justice has to be served. Or aren't you interested in justice? We want to catch your co-criminals. But the sequence of events baffles me. There is something about you. You are a strange woman. I don't know why I keep having this superstitious belief that I've seen you before. Unlike other people, since you came into this cell, one or two things have occurred. Strange events. So tell me, who are you?
Ya. Ya. You are you are you have my shoot police. Finished. Say welcome to this your land. This is your new city. And say bye bye to that other world. Because it's over for you. Idiot. <laughs> Something's alright. Have you transferred her? Call with me now. When we came in, we pull the suspect. Huh? Where is Jibola? I'm sorry, sir. I don't know. Jibola sent me to go and get food for both of us. Didn't meet him when I returned, sir. And the suspect is still too? She's there, sir. That cell is empty. No, no, she's there, I sir. I said it's empty! Are you listen to me, officers? We have to find Jibola and the missing suspect. Huh? Apart from the DJ's office that you don't have the keys to, your officers will search every square inch of this ground. Is that clear? Yes, sir. Now move! Actually, I put a call to him. It was ringing, but no response. That's not his answer. I want results. We have to find Jibola and the missing suspect. You guys have to search him. Keep searching. Search! Every corner, go ahead! Sir, sir. Sir. not as bad as you sound. Oh, I haven't really gotten any message from her that did yet, so... Is Francisca going with you? Yes, I talked to her about it and she's coming along with me. And have you told your employers? Yes, I have. Okay. I wouldn't miss that out. <laughs> not to worry, I'll give you something for your dad. Okay? Thank you very much. Alright. Our individual reputation in the world of crime. We only came together when it became apparent that together we could be stronger. Who is your leader? Atoyo. Atoyo Black. At least that's what you know him as. Obviously, 
That is his nickname. Hmm? Now, I want you to give us all the names of the members of this terrible syndicate. Okay, I will. But first, sir, please, I would like to cut the deal. A deal. Okay. Let's hear it. I think it is only fair if I'm not dealt with the largest sledge armor. If I help you win in this name you so long sought for. Well, obviously it, it can be worked out. But the fact that you shot a police officer would get you the longest time in jail. Hmm? Whichever way you look at it. But we can work out something if you cooperate with us. I will. To cooperate and give us the names. All the names. His name. So you mean to tell me that that guy said all that? Um, to you? That guy is a proper criminal. Are you serious? He is a criminal. <laughs> mm. I don't envy this your job at all. I mean, we need all sorts. All sorts of people. Yeah. Hello? What? Specifically sent for you because I don't want to ask ASP Kabiru these questions alone. Can somebody tell me what is going on here? Sir, uh, I don't understand what you mean, sir. So, sir! The deaths in this station. The men in your team seem to be dropping dead like flies. I have been going on with this notion, but I have not got the explanation for this sudden spark of deaths in this station. And it all seemed to have started when this girl Melody was arrested and detained and later released and then her sudden death and then her sudden and mysterious death tell me is there something somebody knows that I don't know about this girl's death or do any of you know anything about her death or so we are equally worried about the mysterious turn of events, sir. We are all confused, sir. Very confused, sir. But she was the only female officer on duty the last the melody was seen. So uh, maybe we could uh, succeed in appealing to our maternal uh, instinct. Okay. All right. I pray I get a better point, a better look this time than the last time I met with her. I um, hope so. Okay. Um, then let's go.
I called you to see this. There is a breakage on the frontal bony part of his head. The strange thing is that the same breakage occurred exactly the same spot the other two skull x-rays occurred. Really? Yeah. You can easily see that the source of the wound came as a result of the blue from front. Why I am concerned about the pattern of the killing is whoever that must have struck the subject dead did not face any single resistance. Naturally and under normal circumstances, one should raise his hand in self-defense in this kind of situation. But from what I can see here, the subject did little or nothing to defend themselves here. I think they were demobilized by fear. It means that we have a serial killer or assassin on the loose. I think, I think it's, it's, it's time we let the PO in the actual event that came out. You know, as we are going to join house now to convince her on this issue, I know that she's going to, I know it's going to be difficult, but, but we need to let her know. <laughs> Sir, please, the way our men are dying is not usual. Let's critically analyze this thing. It's a nightmare. Sir, seriously, we just have to go to Joyce as we are going now, which she must confess. She has to confess and we have to let the PO know everything. Please, sir, let's forget about our lame fears. That's my own stand on this, sir. Simple, sir. Make them beg every man, everyone. Make them beg. They can try to disguise. They can run, they can hide. But they will never get to me. Make them beg. Please, Joyce. Yeah, I'm afraid to inform you that the nature of the trauma to this call in this letters is consistent with the pattern seen in the other deaths. I wouldn't want to infer anything here. But I'm beginning to feel that the time for reasoning has come. Yeah, that's... Um, what about the woman in War 10? I'm going to see her now. Alright, do and get back to me, okay? Alright. Uh, doctor. Yeah? Are you serious? I am. Um, please, doctor, what does that mean?
are referring me from the bar. Oh, oh. Are you blind? I'm Kabiru. Can't you see me? ASP. Strange thing is the postmortem. It shows that the crack on her head, which is responsible for her death, occurred exactly at the same spot as that of Melody and my other colleagues that died recently. Yuzu, this is frightening. Yes, What Jesus told you is the truth. They all died in the same way. I think it's logical to consider linking the pieces of the jigsaw with here. Confession, sir. Binka. Sir. Kabiru. Where have you been? Sir. Sir. We have to confess, sir. Sir, we have a confession. Sir. Alright, get into the car. Get into the car! Okay, sir. Officer. What is this? Sir, I'm sorry. Uh, uh, sir, sir, sir. Okay. All right. 
Okay, 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 I get it. What is wrong with you? It's a mother again and we are too happy not too long ago. Uh-huh. What about her? Uh, actually, it's... we keep her, sir. What are you talking about? logical before I lose my temper, brother. Spirit, it's not to What spirit? What spirit? Spirit, 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 sir. Remember the barrier we told you we were going for? The girl's barrier, sir. Yes, so what about the barrier? Yes, sir. For a very long time. Ah, no, now it's hard to believe. Hi, ah, this is sad. Ah, ah, even my own Dinka, Dinka of all people, was involved in this all along, and I didn't know. 
Ah, and even to my dear friend, Melody. Julius, please. I and Francisca will need your help. We have to work towards the modalities of an acceptable compensation. Of course, we know that life cannot be paid for. But someone has definitely got to pay for this one. Someone has got to pay for the death of my dear friend. Ah! Um, I understand. Um, but you know what? As soon as I leave here, I'll be on it. Please do. Someone has got to pay for this. That person cannot go scot free. Ah, well, I will do something. Melody, Melody. Lady, thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, I, I, honestly, I, I don't know how to express, you know, or oh, appreciate the, the maturity, the candor, the, the, the reasonableness that both of you have shown in this matter. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, You see, extrajudicial killing is a serious crime. And if met with the full weight of the law, <laughs> I wonder if I can even survive it. You know. Like we earlier agreed. I will make sure that the settlement package is significant. I promise you that. But as for Kabiru and Dimka, let me assure you that they will be duly punished for their complicity in this matter. Alright? Once again, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, thank you very much. Thank you. Well, Mr. Dipio, we want to say we are grateful also. We want to thank you for your immense contribution. As it is, there's really no much time for too many words. If us will believe that the spirit of the disease is an esprit of vengeance, the faster we are pleased to bereaved, the better for us all. So please, we want you to act as fast as possible, please. Of course. Of course we will. The police is always your friend, no matter what. All right. We will remain your friends. Please. Once again, thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Elizabeth, you have cried enough. I want you to know that nothing happens in life without the knowledge of God. The death of your daughter Melody is not the end of your life. Remember Naomi in the Bible? a woman that lost her husband and her two sons. She was still courageous and moved on in life. The God you serve will always be there for you. Melody's death is not ordinary. Same with that of your husband. The God you serve will always be there for you. It is the same God that's the God, that's the, that, that's the husband to the widow, that's the father to the fatherless, that's the child to the childless. The most important thing we need to work on now is to make heaven, which is the number one goal of every born again Christian. I am home. I mean, where else would I be? Okay. Thank you. But the DPO, he wants to come over. Oh, that's good. Okay, um, no problem. I, I intend to give my leave. But I would want you to know something. Always pray and read the Bible. And with time to time, I will always come to study the word of God with you and pray with you. It is not the end of the world. Let us pray. Father, I need you, I need you, I need you.
Madam, on behalf of the Inspector General of Police, the State Commissioner of Police, and the entire Nigerian Police, I have come to express our condolence and sympathy. Oh 